Hey everyone, this is Steve from Publish Press here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the Publish Press Checklist plugin to make sure that your content is ready to go live. We're going to focus on images in this video. I have a site already set up with checklists installed, and I've gone to the checklist link in my admin menu. As you scroll down through these different requirements, you'll see that you can control the number of characters in the title of your posts. You can set a maximum or minimum number for that. The number of words in the content, the number of categories, the number of tags, all sorts of useful things to make sure that your content meets your standards. And if you scroll down, you'll find two different requirements to optimize the images in our content. One, an alt text for all images. An alt text is a, a sentence or some keywords which help describe the image if the image is disabled for some reason. It also helps search engines and it's really useful to make sure that you have alt text on all the images in your content. And for many of you, when you're publishing a post, you want to have a good looking featured image on your content. And you can also make this required. So we have two requirements. One will make sure that we have alt text for all images, and one will make sure that we have a featured image for the post. What I'm going to do now is create a post and see these tasks on the site. When I go to create a new post, the checklists are gonna be down here in the right sidebar. One of them is green by default, simply because I don't have any images, so there's nothing to get um, upset about. And one of them is in red because I do not have a featured image. Let's show you how this works. This is a post with images. And if I add an image, I'm gonna to go to my media library and find this image here. The alt text box in the right is empty when I first add the image. And you'll see that the alt text requirement has now turned to red because I do have an image and it does not have any alt text. If I go back to the block setting, I can enter a useful piece of alt text. This is a photo of two people working in a coffee shop. And let me look at my requirements. Okay, this one is now green. What about the featured image? Well, if I look at the featured image box, it's empty. I don't have one. Fortunately, I have a photo of some palm trees in here. And let's see what the checklist does. Ah, now it's all green. If I do want to go back and add more images here, I am going to have to make sure that all of them have alt text. Otherwise, I'm gonna see this warning sign on the publish icon. No matter how hard I click, I'm not going to be able to publish this content. I'm going to have to go back and add an alt tag to this image, which is a good thing. This is going to help people who may be reading my site with the images off for one of many reasons. And it's also going to help with my site's search engine optimization as well. Okay, I've added the alt text for that image. My checklists are now all in green. I can hit publish and I'm all good to go. So the checklists plugin is really useful for making sure your content meets your standard. You can make sure that you have the maximum and minimum number of words you need in the title and in the body. You can make sure you have the correct number of categories or tags, the correct number of links and that all the links are working. And as we've seen in this video, you can make sure that all your images have alt text and that you have a featured image which represents your content really well. So if you haven't used it yet, head over to wordpress.org and grab the Publish Press Checklist plugin. It really is the best way to make sure that your content is ready to go live on your site.